Hey guys, just putting together a really brief video on array merge uh, function PHP, where you can merge um, two or more as many arrays as you want together um, to create one array. So how we're gonna do this is uh, I have three arrays, and uh, I'm just gonna show you <coughs> what we have before and um, the results after using array merge. So let's go ahead and do that. So essentially, we're gonna have three arrays, one containing ABC, one containing DEF, one containing uh, G. And uh, then after the merge, we should see one array with all of these characters. So let's go ahead and run that. So as you can see, uh, before the merge, we had three arrays, and now we have um, we have a single array, and uh, they're all um, the indexes, numeric indexes for array merge are never preserved. And so even if I go here. and give numeric indexes to these values. Go ahead and save that. We're gonna see the exact same value. So we shouldn't see any changes here, right? However, um, with string keys for array merge if we do have a string key for example a what we're going to see here is um, this value here is going to be overridden by this value because um, the last string key um, generally overwrites um, the first value and that's how array merge works so if we run this we're going to see f b c d e g okay and again this this value is preserved because it's a uh, string key. And again, if we do the same in our third array, uh, now we're going to see B, C, D, E, or sorry, uh, G, B, C, D, E. That's it. So let's go ahead and run that. Okay, so uh, yeah, that's just a very, very brief video if there's any additional questions. Um, yeah, just let me know and uh, go ahead and practice through this. Again, um, you can add as many arrays that you want to merge. So if you add a fourth or fifth, go ahead and play around with that. Um, just remember, numeric keys are appended to the um, to the final resulting array, and they're never preserved. But um, string keys are overridden, so just be mindful of that. Okay, thanks, guys.